loan from Caracas, Venezuela. If you can come to visit, you can do it anytime. My name is Eduardo. I'm the chaplain uh, here at International Christian School in Caracas, Venezuela. I got to know uh, many other teachers that are coming from other countries. Ryan and uh, his friend Daniel, they, we, be, we have become good friends, really, really good friends. And I'm so glad to be working with people like them because uh, I have felt really blessed by them. And uh, thank you for supporting them to come here and help us down here. Uh, it's a kind of rough uh, place to come to work and all that. From Plaza Venezuela home, but I don't know how to avoid looking like we're American. So. Uh, they are really courageous and they really love kids, they really love school, they really love everyone here. And they are feeling really well by working here. And they are actually adapting really well to the culture. Not, not really, okay? It's the same in our minds. We all have a bias towards something. This has a bias. The author of this has a way he thinks or she thinks, and they're trying to convince us of that bias. Even if they're not trying to actively do it, as they're writing, their bias is going to come out. And and even the Roman officer in charge of the execution he was in charge of killing Jesus, is awed by what happened. Reverently, he looks at the man who forgave his enemies, and he says, Truly, this man is the Son of God. John James. Okay. All right, are you ready? They're going to open them together. Ready? One, two, three. What's inside? Nothing. Nothing? Oh. What? Wait, let me check here. Oh, that's empty. We must have given you the wrong one. There's nothing in them. There's <gasps> one God, no one. Why is there nothing inside these eggs? Why is there nothing inside them? Because we, because we, already... because we used everything already? No, think about the story. Think about the Bible story. Why is there nothing? What do you think, David and Abby? Why is there nothing inside these eggs? Because he said that. 